Hey, what's up everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Dragon City and this video is all about the new fog island, the Cursed Crypt Island. So here we start off in the center of the map and we got to decide which direction to go in. Now, I'm going to try a new strategy this time. I've been doing my best to get these fog coins. I've been getting every window as much as I can and watching all the videos in Dragon TV. And hopefully this is going to work out well. Now, my plans are long uh, long story short here, my plans are to get the Grave Lurker Dragon and to get all of the chests for the Heroic Race event. Now, if my calculations are correct, it should be 6,770 fog coins. At the moment, I have 4,085 of the fog coins, and with uh, the windows remaining in an uh, a day in 17 hours, we've got about uh, 3,000 more fog coins remaining. There should be five more uh, windows where we're able to get the 600 fog coins there. So five times 600 equals 3,000. We should be good to go. Here, I should be able to get about 7,000 maze coins, and that's not including, just gotta say, make sure you're watching those Dragon TV videos, that's not including the fog coins over here. So check that out. And here, there's some really good orbs or dragons if you're lucky. So here, I'm definitely going to be watching the videos in Dragon TV today and then back to business over here, Fog Island. So here, we are going to take a route. I've already kind of uh, mapped it out here, so hopefully this, uh, this is, my calculations are correct. Here, we're going to start off by going down. Here, we're going to open up this first chest over here, getting some nice resources there, and then we are going to go down once more. So this is the second down step that we take. Beautiful, some good resources there, and a dragon rescue key, love it. And then here, we're gonna go down a third time. Beautiful. So now we've gone to the bottom three times. Ooh, nice resources there, I love it. And hello, on the left-hand side right here, we've got our first gravestone chest. And this is gonna give us some gargoyles. Hopefully we get three, otherwise we can get two or one. And here, big money, big money, no whammies. Come on, let's go. Oh, of course we only got one, but this is just beginning. Here. Now that we've gone down three spaces and we got that first gargoyle chest, here I'm gonna start moving to the right. I mean, sorry, I'm dyslexic sometimes. I'm gonna start moving to the left. Anyways, mixing things up here. Here, we're going to the left-hand side and we're just gonna go through that. We just got a hunger dragon piece, but I'm not gonna be getting the hunger dragon. So here, ba -da 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 -da, we've got another beautiful chest there with some really nice resources. Awesome. And then here, ooh, another gravestone chest. Let's go. Let's get ourselves some more of these gargoyles. And here, oh, only one. Okay. So we're not having too much luck there, but it's okay. Here, our next step. Um, let's see. Doesn't really matter if we go to the left or we go down. We could go either way. Here, I'm going to go to this chest because it's calling me. I think there's going to be some good resources in here. Hey, not too shabby. I'll take the food any day. And here, our next piece is going to be the first piece of the Grave Lurker Dragon. So here, I'm going to go ahead, save those, uh, use those fog coins, invest them, and we're going to go and move down another space, getting this gold chest here. Ooh, nice. Good amount of food there. I'll take that. So here, this fog maze, a great way to get food. Here, our next space is going to be for the Skull Lantern. And this is going to be another item for the event that's going on right now. So here, you just got another Skull Lantern. Now, gargoyles, Skull Lanterns, what are these? Well, they're for the Curse of the Crypt event, which has seven days and 17 hours left in it. Here, I already collected the first rewards in a previous video, but we just got enough of the gargoyles and the lamps to get the pair with skull lanterns rewards and here we can get some epic rewards is that four five dark chests no way here we're going to be able to get some dark habitat tokens and oh my goodness there are five dark chests oh my lantis here we go bring on the rewards so here we just got 150 of the dark habitat tokens here we've got a dark chest with 212,000 food. Another dark chest with 212,000 food. Are we going to get a dark egg? Ooh, another 200,000, uh, 212,000 food. Fourth chest with food. And then here the fifth and final. Oh, hey, well, we just got over a million a million food. So even though we didn't get any dark dragons, I'm super stoked. A million food is just what we need for the heroic race that's going on at the moment. And back to the Fog Island event. Yeah. So here we just got that uh, lantern there. And now 
we are going to go to the right. We're going to get the gold chest. So we're keeping this going. And here we should have another gargoyle chest after this. Yes, beautiful. So here we've got the gravestone chest right there. We're going to go ahead and get that. Yeah, there we go. Now our, start, our luck's starting to turn. Here we got two of the gargoyles there. And here we've got a gold chest. So we're going to go ahead, get that beauty there. Yas queen, some more food. Awesome. Here I'm going for the silver chest next beautiful and that just gave us a bunch of resources there and next up hello we have the second piece of the grave lurker dragon so we're crushing it there and here next thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the right and here we have a silver chest after this we're going to go to the right again with a bronze chest beautiful and ooh, nice resources there Ooh, and here we've got the third piece for the Grave Lurker Dragon. Crushing it. Oh, yeah. So here we're doing an amazing job. And my next move is I'm going to go down one space. So here we've got the silver chest there. Beautiful. So here, this is looking super good. We got that there. Here, uh, that is the Socks for One Dragon. The Socks for One Dragon is in the bottom right corner. And the bottom left corner... Um, I forget the name of the dragon, but uh, this is the bottom left corner. I think it's the hunger dragon. Yeah, so bottom left corner is the hunger dragon there. And then the specter dragon is it, uh, the specter dragon is in the top left corner. And then the chainmail dragon is in the top right corner. Anyways, here, back to business. And by the way, there's a link in the video description below if you want to know uh, where I'm getting all this information from. I've got two links in the video description below that I'm going to be sharing, and I'll be explaining them more as we progress here. So here, next move. Uh, we just... Uh, here we went up, we went down, we just got that chest there. And here I think I have to go for the gold chest next to the right hand side. And there should be another gravestone chest on the right here. Yes, okay, that was the right move, beautiful. So here we're gonna go ahead, open this up there. And nice, here we just got a gargoyle and that's looking fabulous. And then next, hmm, what's my next move here? Well, I am gonna have to wait. Here, I'm out of fog coins, but my next move is I'm actually going to go down and, well, long story short, if you want to see my next move, click the first link in the video description below. Now, I went to a website called ditlep.com and, uh, well, you're able to create your own route on that website. So I built my own route, which is super cool. And the first link in the video description below is the route that I built. And it's the route that I intend on taking. Now here, honestly, I'm not 100% sure if these calculations are correct. Now we've made a lot of progress, but I just spent over 4,000 of the fog coins and I feel like I have a lot of the maze still left to go. We'll see where the wind blows. Um, here, I noticed that there was one miscalculation on the website. They mentioned that there's still 4,800 free coins still remaining with the deliveries, but it's only 3,000. So I know there's one math calculation that's off there, but I'm going to keep this going and we'll see where the wind blows. Um, you know, my intentions are here. We're going to go to the bottom right corner as much as we can. And there's another gravestone chest there. Then we're going to go up. A uh, couple moves, we'll eventually see a gold chest on the left-hand side, and then we're going to start go going left. We're going to be able to get the next piece of the Grave Lurker Dragon, and then we're going to go up one, right one, get ourselves another lantern, and then we'll be somewhere uh, near the middle here. So then we're going to go back over to the left one space, which should only cost us one move. Then we're gonna get another gravestone chest, and then we're gonna go up, 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 get a gold chest, and then right to get another gravestone chest. Then we're gonna go up, up, up. We get another piece of the gravestone, uh, the grave lurker dragon. Then we go up to the right. Then we get a chest for the grave pieces there. Um, the gravestone chest, and then we go up some more. We get another grave lurker dragon piece. Then we start going to the 
left. So now we're going all the way to the left and we're looking for the last pieces of the Grave Lurker Dragon and a couple more of those Gargoyle chests. Hey, we'll see if I manage to pull this off here. I'm not 100% sure about the math. I don't know if my calculations are 100%, but make sure you stay tuned for the part two of this video. And, well, do the calculations for yourself. Check out the two links in the video description below and do your research so you can get the dragons that you're looking for or the chests that you're looking for. And most of all, good luck with everything. I'm not 100% sure of the accuracy of everything I'm sharing. So, um, you know, take this with a grain of salt. Uh, this is what I'm trying. I'm doing an experiment here. I haven't done this before and I'm going to let you know how it works. If it doesn't work, I'll tell you if it works. Well, oh, we are going to be having some fun. So thank you so much for watching. And if you want to see part two of the Cursed Crypt Fog Island video, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell for notifications. And if you enjoyed this video, you can also help me out by hitting that thumbs up button for the like. Hey, I hope to see you soon, everybody. Happy gaming and good luck with everything going on. Take care and, oh yeah, definitely good luck with the heroic race. Right now, I'm in the middle of filming my lap nine video and I'm doing pretty good. Here we're on lap nine, node four, and I have to feed my dragons and I have to get items from battles. So we've got another battle in 11 minutes. So, well, I'll be getting back to that. Hey, another video you can look forward to seeing. Thanks again, everybody. Happy gaming. Hope to see you soon. Peace.